Hey everyone, we are here at the Ancient Ram Inn in Wooden Under Edge, or Wotton Under Edge, not quite sure. Very excited, we've got the whole place to ourselves. It's just us and the girls. Yeah. Wonder what we're going to find. The Ancient Ram Inn in Wotton Under Edge, Gloucestershire, England, is famed for its rich and eerie history. It's considered one of the most haunted sites in the country. The inn was built in 1145 and was originally intended to house slaves and workers involved in the construction of St. Mary's Church. Over the centuries, it has served many purposes, including being a public house. The ancient Ram Inn is reputedly built on a pagan burial ground, which some believe is the source of its alleged paranormal activity. There are numerous legends and reported sightings of ghosts, including that of a Roman centurion on horseback, a young girl called Rosie, and a malevolent spirit known as the Witch, who was reportedly burned at the stake in the 1500s during the height of the Witch persecutions. We are now in what was called the Witch's Bedroom because allegedly at one time there was a witch that hid in this room from the authorities. I think they were trying to catch her and burn her. Uh, so what we have done is we have placed Anne and that um, spirit talker just said injury on a bed here and she has cat balls and would you like to point to the cat balls? Um, I think there's one between my boobs and there's one about there and another one down there. Okay. Now we've got two on your crutch now. Oh, they've rolled in together now. <laughs> but what can you do? Two balls always seem to attract together. Two balls are better than one. You've got to be even, remember? Mm -hmm. yeah. So Anne is now um, the trigger object here. Touch me. <laughs> and it's a trigger object. And uh, we're going to try and see if we can get some sort of a uh, connection, something going on. And also, um, Lisa has the SLS X cam. My childhood. Your childhood. Yes. Lisa has the SLS X cam here. Uh, so we're going to see if we can actually map anything on the SLS. No figures currently, but I did see one before standing right next to her head. Oh, right, okay. So whoever is here, whether it is the alleged witch who found herself here asking for sanctuary and was hidden, or whoever came through to find the witch and witch. take her away, if you can step forward, please and make yourself known. So we have some items here on the floor that will light up sister. if you get close. Oh, it better not have been your sister because that's just a sad story then. No, she is a sister. Oh, she is a sister, right, okay. Sisters, S-I-T-S-I-S-T-A. Oh, I don't know whether that was known in the uh, 16th century. She's recognizing you. Okay. So, if you are here, if you are here and present, please, step forward. I'm just shutting this door. We may never get out again. And I'm just going to step back. I'm asking the witch, the lady that was scarred through being accused of stupid things that were just male fantasy. Let's just say that. Let's just point the finger there and go some stupid male. We fought here. I bet you did. Decided that they would accuse you because you may have been a healer. Positive. Yep or someone who assisted in the vicinity here, in the community. 
and uh, they tried to keep you safe in this house. Can you come forward please? Can you touch Anne again on the shoes, on the feet? She's got the shoes off the bed so if that's what you were talking about or trying to get her to move those uh, shoes up off the bed. If you can make any of the light balls that are on her at the moment light up. Was that the REM pod that was beeping? I think that's the mill. Oh, the mill. If you can show yourself in any way at all, please, for us. My right foot feels like it's being pulled down. Your right foot? Yeah. Interesting. There's a REM pod straight under your right foot, which isn't reacting. Footsteps follow. Footsteps follow. Oh. We'll listen out. Just give her a big nudge so she doesn't fall asleep. Did you sleep here? Was this the room that gave you comfort? Did you feel as though you were protected in here? Bells to keep the bad spirits away. That was the REM pod, that beep there. And you can see there's a, a, a light flashing on that REM pod. Just stopped. Oh, it's still going. Oh, is that the temperature change? What's happening? No. What's happening to that REM pod there? The light's flashing, but there's no sound coming out of it. I don't know if you can see it on camera. I can hear a beep, beep. Yeah, yeah. Beep, beep. It's from the REM pod on the left hand side of you. You can see it flashing, but there's no actual sound going off. No step, step closer, use your energy, make it stronger for us, please. What colour is it flashing? Red. A little red dot. Means it's getting warmer. Can you believe it? I was going to say it doesn't feel like it. <laughs> Maybe you can help us understand a little bit more about you. Do you have permission to come and touch the balls that have been placed on me? If you want to fling them off, Anne, you can. Oh, it just went off. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, just after we asked, after you gave permission. I have not moved. Thank you. See how excited we all got? That's nuts. Thank Oh, and it's interesting it? that the light on the REM is still going off as well. Yeah. And it's all on that. Wow, that was pretty awesome. Thank you. Just like I said, we, we do want to understand a little bit more about you. Was this a safe place for you? If you feel that it was a safe place for you, can you once again make that light that you lit up on Anne light again? You have permission. Or maybe they told you it was a safe place, but it, but it wasn't. I hope they didn't set you up. Oh. It, the light had been going off the whole time, but there was no volume on it. Are you angry about what happened to you? Henry. Henry. Is your Ooh, light bulb? Is, is your anger making those lights go off? I'd be angry too. You may 
maybe able to light up one of the other light bulbs that are on Anne. Maybe the one underneath. Ah, yeah. That one's on again. Yeah, can you do the one underneath that as well? A little bit further down. Mm. She might enjoy that. Mm. When you were taken from here, did they hurt you? I'm sorry that they did that. I'm really, really sorry. Can somebody press the middle button of the three small buttons on the rim pod, please? Totally. It's still... Are you sure it's the middle? No. <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry they hurt you. It's not fair. It's not fair for any woman to have gone through what you went through. Jeff. Sounds like yes from here. Uh, this said Jeff. Yeah. Sometimes they don't have all the words they need on there, so they'll choose a word that sounds similar to the word they want to use. I found that with painful. the ovulus. Painful. Oh, painful about the torture. You'll be glad to know that things are slowly changing. Slowly, but they are changing. Women are still getting a hard time. Still being bossed around by men. Weird, I just felt like I had all these pins and needles go right through both the bottom part of my legs at the same time, as well as a little tickle on the bottom of my right foot. Oh. Have you heard of OnlyFans? <laughs> <laughs> we enjoy the company. Oh, I'm so glad that you do. I hope you speak nice and loudly so that people can hear Shall you. Shall I make noise? Yes! Please. Just listening for the noise, but not hearing anything. Can you make louder noises? You can open and close the door if you want to. Please move forward. Okay. I'll move forward a little bit. Is that better for you? Did they hang you before they burnt you? Apparently, in most cases, that's what they did to women. They hanged them first and then they burnt them at the stake. They didn't burn that many women, really, historically. But I'm wondering whether you were hanged. Or maybe you were just imprisoned. So can you light a ball up if you were hanged, please? And here are the ones... Well, we are filming you, yes. Yeah, we are. I hope that's okay. Were you imprisoned? I can't conjure. 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 I can't see Anne's head, all I see is fluff. <laughs> I think she's fallen asleep. No, I haven't, but I'm going to. <laughs> Can you do something to ensure she doesn't fall asleep? Give her a big pinch. Touch my balls. Give her a pinch. <laughs> pinch her. Poke her. So I just laughed then. Did any of the balls flash? Nope. No. Interesting. Yeah, they're not easily set off. I think I'm more in danger of Sid. becoming a popsicle. Sid, S-I-D. Mm. 
Do you visit here often? Sorry, that was me, obviously. I think we've kind of lost the lost the energy. Mm. I might have to try something else. As we took a short break in the ancient Ram Inn's kitchen, it appears we may have piqued the interest of one of the resident spirits. You decide. All right, so we've got something mapping. Just changed. It's headless. And it's climbing up Barb's shoulder. It's... Are you feeling anything, Barb? Mm, no, not really. Okay. It's dancing on your shoulder. Do me a favour, mm -hmm. take two steps to your right. Me? Yep. Okay, now I'm going to move as well. It's not a shadow. Yes, yeah, so I'm, what I'm trying to do is see if it's one of our shadows and it's mapping it. So you t take a step to your right, Renata. see your face in it. <laughs> it's gone. Gone. That's it. Demon's gone. Now put Barb back down. I'm going to try something again. Can you step back in please? Come back in. I know we sound funny. We're from Australia. Oh. Oh, thank you. Um, if that is you, could you move your leg out to touch Barb, please? That's the lady sitting on the chair there. Can you move your leg out to touch her? I'd prefer an arm, not a leg. Anyway. Well, the leg is there. So I'm working with what we got. They're using their impressive size to uh, intimidate us. Gone. Gone. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, it's interesting that I'm in the same spot. If I move back here, I'm in the same spot that I was before. Um, I'm going to turn off the light because I'm just I'm wanting to see whether it's mapping the squares on that door, which could be a reflection, our reflection. Of course, now I can't see a freaking thing, can I? <laughs> oh, there be the chair. <laughs> Found it. I thought I'd put it back under the table. Obviously not. Can you come back to the doorway, please? If you could stand in the doorway again for us, please. That's interesting. There is nothing there, whereas before there was. If it was something that... Um, we're kind of catching that's like there permanently. It would come back mm. as a permanent thing, like um, when we were in New Orleans. But now, if I turn the light back on, remembering where that chair is now, let's see if Stay it comes back on. Oh, because okay, it's back now. Hold on. So what's it picking up on? It's... All right, if I turn around and come back, they'll probably, probably laugh at me if I 
trip over again. Because there's nothing there. The only thing I can think of is there's a, a, a sign with a circle on it, but it's not mapping ahead. Yeah, it's not mapping ahead. Dance it on your shoulders again. Trying, well, they're kicking her in the head. I did say to reach out and touch her. <laughs> Trying to knock some sense into me. I did just ask for someone to come into the doorway again, just before it appeared. Could you jump over onto her other shoulder, please? Over to the other side, over to this side over here, or invite a friend to come in. I'm still not convinced there's not mapping something on the door. Yeah, I'd... yeah. But this is Bill's. This isn't the um, the bodgy dodgy ones that are out there. So that's but definitely if it, if, like when we were asking for it to do something that was um, like very specific, yeah. and if it went to the other side, I'd be going, "Holy moly! Wow, that's amazing!" Yeah, because um, that's asking to do something very different. But but we have it here tonight, so we're going to um, do a little bit tonight and see what we can get with it because this is what we're all about a bit of experimentation absolutely so we've decided to put some equipment around this area here this is where Barb was before and felt that there was a fair bit of activity hello so we've put a tripwire around we've put cat balls down we have put REM pods down uh, and we're just going to really work in this space uh, just for a little while and see whether we can get uh, some more activity here. So let's see what happens. Shouldn't be here. Well, who shouldn't be? We shouldn't be here. Don't you like our company? Excuse me. How can we help you? Maybe we've been inappropriate. Did you not like us mucking around and having fun and laughing before? I think a lot of that would have happened here after a few ales. I get the feeling like we've been joined by a priest. Please stop. Why? Why do we need to No. Stop? Why? Tell me why we need to stop. We're being very respectful. Have we offended I you? said so. Yeah, but why? Why? Just because you said to stop doesn't mean we're going to stop. Is Can you tell us what bothered you the most? They brought me here. Was it not of your own, so not of your own free will? By myself? What did you do? Why did they bring you here? But I tried. Help. Help. Always happy to help. What's your name? Help. What's your name? My name's Anne. I just need to know your name and I'll help you happily. About the back. What's your name? Already smashed. Come on, give me a name. Can you tell us what happened in that well? Someone! What happened in that well down there? Well? <laughs> in the well? In well, yeah. don't leave me in suspense. Come on. Walk by. I nearly walked into it earlier. 
Did somebody die down there? There's a dagger. Wasn't there a dagger? There? I'm still there? You're he's, still down he's there? still stuck down the well. I hope not. Come up. Come and join us for if a chat. If you've got long black hair that's hanging over your face, I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's awfully lonely down there if you're down there by yourself. Because you said you needed help. I hope you're not trapped down there. Three went in. And how many came out? Mm -hmm. Whatever. Can you tell me how many? If three went in, how many came out, please? Pushed. Into the well. Deep. Don't touch. I won't touch it. Well, I hope nobody put bodies or anything down there. That would contaminate the water supply. It'd make everyone sick. My son? Hmm? Is he a good boy? He blew it. No. Oh, it was a naughty Not boy. into the well, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> Was he a naughty boy? Did he get in trouble? Disturbing. Yeah, I can be. <laughs> Not blessed. No. 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 Unholy, isn't she? He went. Oh, oh so down. Back. We're talking about. Yes. Wow, we're talking about your son. They are there. Spirit. And the next one. Do we need to get a priest to cast them out? Maybe he was the one that put them down there. They were little. Oh, oh. that's not good. Were they children? I thought I just saw something run across, a black shadow run across the back of Renata's chair there. Again, is it fatigue? I don't know, but I could have sworn I saw it. Uh, uh, lots of trouble. Lots of trouble. They attacked me. What did you do? People just don't attack you for no reason normally. So what did you do? Locked in a room. I didn't say you deserved it. I just wanted to know what you did that upset them. Fake. Did somebody make something up about you? Wizard. <laughs> People watching. I jumped. Oh, they claimed you were a wizard. Oh. Oh, so they claimed you were doing black magic, or did they? They were women. Yep. What did they call the women? They watched it happen. And they didn't do a bloody thing, did they? they Women. They made shit up. Get her out. Sorry. Oh, do you not want Anne in this space? If you want her to get out, tell her. Don't make me. Dear. So get out. Who's there? Anne. Mrs. Anne Redovich to you. you got to say for yourself? Wizard? You have no power over me. Can you show us some of your wizardry? Quick, come, quick, quick. I'm here. I don't think I can get here much quicker than I already am. Where, where do we need to go though? What, what part of this? Read. Notes. Plenty. I was going to say, there's lots of notes written around mm -hmm. here everywhere. I did that. Which one? John, is this you? Yeah. Oh, hi, John. Thank you for coming to talk to us. I'm, like I'm back. Oh, you're back? I don't think you ever left. I yeah. love your leather jackets. They are beautiful. Gorgeous. 
Yep. See this? Yeah, we just saw a light go. Is that amazing. you? Did you do that? See? Yeah, I know. You're I like it. You like it? I hope you're having more fun with us than you are. Some of you're the up there. Yeah. Smart de pants. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Do I need to go upstairs? Should we head upstairs and talk to you? Yep. Which room? The one with the two beds? I'll be happy. Two beds was the one that flashed on. Witch's room? Walk with me. Okay. Do you want to talk on the board upstairs? The Ouija board? Don't pinch me. Oh, but I'm tempted. You are sort of cute. Do you remember these two ladies from last time they visited? Spirit. Those young 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 guys gave us a dreadful time, didn't they? They weren't very polite. I see. Yeah. It's, it's nice to have them back just on their own now, isn't it? I'm dead. And yeah, I know. I'm really sorry about that. I love you. Oh. Yes. Talk about me. <laughs> um, your daughter's doing a fabulous job looking after your inn. It's simple. You know, I think there's a little bit more to it than that. There'd be a bit of hard work. It's just keeping it right so it's still... He's looks, back. Still looks old. I'm here. You've kept... You've maintained... It's the He's okay. The aesthetic of the place. Yeah, and the character. Say. Let's get out of here. Yeah, where are we going to go? John, what did you think of the Ghost Adventures crew? <laughs> what did you think of them? Walking, oh. walking. <laughs> Honestly. Walk, walk away. <laughs> Uh, tell us. You can tell us. No. Okay. No, stop. Oh. And if you've got nothing nice to say, you don't say it at all. Who's that? That's Barb. She's just standing over there talking to us as well. And that's Lisa over there. Hello. I hope it's okay. We did introduce ourselves a bit earlier. Disturbing. No, I am a bit disturbing, aren't I? Do you have a message for Carolyn? End it. Yes, what? Jim. Jim. Listen. Yeah, we're listening. Sir. Mm. A long time ago. In Bethlehem. Are you going to tell us a story? Spilt. Mm. Beer. Yeah, they spilt beer. Yep. And. I thank you. That was a great story. <laughs> Short and sweet. I was riveted from beginning to end. <laughs> Is that a question? No, I wasn't. I, I truly was. I was. That hurts. Sorry, I didn't mean to offend you, but I, I was listening to every single word, wondering what was going to come out. What was your drink of choice? What did you enjoy? We know English. You didn't do it. Do you have a favourite drink? You? No. <laughs> Don't. Mm. Want that. Really? How do you know? How do you know what I want? Do you have a problem with drinking? Some people can't drink alcohol very well. Helen. Hmm. Was she someone special to you? Responsible for everything that happened. Oh, okay. Good or bad? Too much. Don't give away too many secrets. Miserable. Oh. She made you miserable. Oh, the oh, same. I oh God! See so if we can find it to uh, look up to see. Do not like it. 
if that name is poor people. Um, Helen, next door. Relevant. Yeah, see if it's relevant. Oh, next door. What happened next door? The poor people next door. Nineteen. I was about to say what. What decade are we in? <laughs> in Nineteen what? Twenty. Oh. It's here. Right, okay. Was this in between the wars? This isn't happening. It's it special. It is. Happy birthday. Again. Oh. Happy birthday. I was playing that on the That's piano what I said. before. And we had the cat ball light up when he started to play yeah. Happy Birthday. Whose birthday is it? Can you give us your name, please, so we can sing it sing the song for you? I'm done. Oh, you're doing so well. We've got this whole conversation oh. going. It's so long to listen to, though. Oh. Uh, we think we had John. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Do you <laughs> know... I've told you that. I, you can't go back on because oh. that will influ influence your thoughts. Do you know of anyone by the name of Helen that's no. related to this place? No, I don't. Birthday, like, look, is today's date relevant somehow? I don't know. We've had the thing go off for birthday. Yeah, and we had birthday come through again. And birthday come through again. And uh, John was saying, come on, get out of here. Let's get out of here. And uh, there was a couple of things that we said as we said it. The lights behind you lit up. Oh, and you asked if if you've got a message for Caroline. And then yes. he And then he mentioned... Um, Jim. And something about the poor people next the door. Poor people next and, door, yeah. And I was thinking in my head, I wonder what um, century this is. And as I was about to say, what century, you said 19. I said, oh, uh, 19, okay. Yeah. So what year? 20. Oh. Okay. So I'm thinking, is I said, is it something to do with between the two wars? And then uh, that's when it got on to Helen. It was all... Yeah. And it wasn't it she made it miserable or something? Yeah, or mis something miserable. Said it, it was all because of her or something? Yeah, it was all because of her. Yeah, it was all because of her. Yeah, it was really starting to get interesting. To oh. see if there was a Helen associated mm. with this building with this... or next door. Oh. Or Jim. Or Jim. And something about a birthday. Yes. Or an anniversary. Like, there's got to be something because that's twice we've had birthday come up. Oh, that's so interesting. Two different experiments. Well, we can tell whoever you get in contact with. What we found. What yeah. we found. We can send a well, message. There's a Facebook group actually, so I'll pop it on the Facebook group. Mm. Mm. All right. Just going to stop recording. Even though our experience at the Ancient Ram Inn was incredibly gentle, we couldn't help but feel very privileged to be able to spend the night alone trying to make contact with the spirits that linger there on the dark side.